I honestly cannot imagine a better way to kick off interviews for RuPaul's Drag Race Live Untucked in Las Vegas than the queen herself, Pangina Heels. How's it going, Pangina? It's going well. Thank you for having me. I'm so excited. This is my second time doing the residency here in Vegas. And I'm, you know, just getting ready to be able to perform every single night to a different crowd and doing what I love and just killing it. And Vegas is Sin City, so I am ready to create some sins. Um, okay, let's talk about that because... Are we going to talk about that? Girl. I got to tell you, I've seen the first couple, Girl, couple you know episodes. Him. Don't try to play me. Listen, I know. Josh is a friend of mine, yes. and I see you two getting into some shenanigans on Untucked Live. Did you think that a love story storyline would happen while you filmed this show? I mean, it definitely started with lust. Um, I don't know if that was what they were going for, but honestly, in Sin City, what happens in Vegas goes out onto the world, apparently. But I think, you know, it's it's so funny because I didn't plan for that to happen, and it wasn't like, I'm just gonna go and make out with like a random guy, but that was a, a cute night, and we actually end up dating for like a while, and he came to Thailand, so it wasn't like a like a one-off ho situation. So he, he ended up, you know, we had a great relationship for like, a good five months, which is like 10 years in gay life. And so, um, but now we're just really good friends and I'm just, I hope the best for him, you know? Good person, yeah. Well, and seriously, you've learned living in Vegas. It's a small community here, so no matter what, if you're with somebody or not, you're gonna run into him at Piranha, right? Oh, definitely. Well, Josh is a, a staple um, at Piranha. Every single Friday, Saturday, you can see them either at Gypsy or at Piranha. Tell me I'm wrong. You kind of have a thing for Cameron Turner as no, well. I don't. I don't know what you're talking about. Why am I up talking? No, I think, you know, I think because he's so professional and obviously he's not hard to look at, but it's also his work ethic and he's like a kind of like a teacher for me. And so I was like, oh, just like a little crush more so. It's not like I want to I want to blow him, you know, um, but there's so much like the pit crews are just so nice. Like the boys are so hot. I mean, honestly, if anybody, Jonathan, like, no, he has a wife, but um, wouldn't be the first time. Uh, <laughs> I am only kidding. I swear to God. Is no, she? I just, I, I think I love Jonathan because I'm um, like his sex appeal because when he's dancing, he's gotten that, um, that vibe, you know, like the facials and stuff. We all love a good facial. You know what I mean? Oh, I know oh, that's right. I know that's right. That's dance terminology from having good face when you're dancing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I know that's right. Is it safe to say that you might keep coming back a few more times? Oh, well, please have me. I mean, I'm, I beg of you. <laughs> I mean, here is my application video. Put it in now. Who do I have to blow? <laughs> Let me know. I can pull my whole fist in my mouth. I love how you're so willing to blow anything and everything. Oh, I am serious. Like, I, it's not even a joke at this point. Um, I am from Thailand for a reason. Yes, and um, we are the land of smiles and low jobs. Pangina, thank you so much for taking the time. Congrats on everything, and I cannot wait to see you slay the stage here in Las Vegas. Thank you, darling. Thank Love you.